Uh, my name is Jeff Dietz. I'm the principal at Culpeper County High School. I just finished my fourth year uh, here at the school. Uh, during that period of time, we've, we've spoken a lot about the renovations uh, that, are, that are needed here. Um, from my perspective, it really comes down to an instructional necessity, um, and as well as a safety issue as well. Uh, quick on the safety issue is that our PA system is, is very antiquated. And when the school was designed, they didn't put speakers in the hallway. So when we, we make our announcements, uh, it only goes into the classrooms and into offices. It does not go into the hallway. So if a parent comes in in the afternoon looking for their, their child and we make the announcement, unless they're in a classroom, no one's gonna, the, the child's not going to hear that their parent is, is looking for them. Um, and then from an instructional standpoint, you know, technology, the more, the more we get, the more electrical demand that it has. Um, the older part of the high school only has basically one outlet on each wall and uh, in order to do a lot of the things that we want to do um, with technology you have several plugs per, um, per thing that you're doing. So if you're using a multimedia projector and a, um, an Elmo, uh, which is a document camera, you need, you need two plugs. Plus then you have a computer that you need to, to run through that, so you, you need three but the plug might be on the wrong side of the room for the way that the, the classroom is set up. So when the teacher kind of is forced to arrange their classroom in a certain way, it might not meet the instructional needs that they have. So uh, this is typical of, of some of the electrical closets. There are much smaller electrical panels, but again, um, our concern is the, the panels are obsolete and parts are not available. Uh, so there is that concern that as the building gets, continues to age, without addressing some of those uh, in the wall needs that we have uh, that both from a, a safety a, uh, and an instructional standpoint where we have some, some concerns but also from just say if, if, if things fail then we're going to have to be shut down while they, while they fix it and because the system is so old that it's not a, a simple flip the switch and, and fix it.